I'm going to demonstrate how the CutTheMagazineBlocks.com uh, Universal Pistol Limiter. So for this particular SIG magazine, the marking is at number 13. Um, this is just an example. So we slide this up, find uh, number 13 in the site, uh, the window. And then what we're going to do is cut it flush with the base. So you can use anything. I'm going to use some flush cut pliers that work really well. Let's get it lined up, make sure everything's even, make sure the number's where it should be. And then cut this off. So that can be epoxied into place and inserted into the magazine. Uh, if we want, we can also use the locking tab. This will add about one number in the adjustment window there if you use the tab. If you don't and it sits flush, uh, it takes away about a number. So you can do it either way. You can use your original uh, locking plate. Show an example of that. So here's the original SIG locking plate. We'll just slide this one out. Oh, that one's already epoxied. Let's use the other. So we sit it where it's flush. This is designed so that the spring little curl there will fit into the back of it. That's it. Slide it in, the floor plate back on, you're all set.